As you know, we've been closely following developments in Iraq, especially regarding its economic situation and the dinar's future. And today, we have some positive news from a very important source. JP Morgan CEO meets with Iraqi Prime Minister. According to a recent article, Mr. Jamie Dimon, the CEO of JP Morgan Chase, met with Iraqi Prime Minister Mohammad Shia al Sudani in Washington, D.C. Now, JP Morgan Chase is a huge name in the world of finance. It's one of the biggest banks in the United States. So, why is this meeting important? Banking sector reforms and economic revitalization. During their meeting, they discussed the Iraqi government's efforts to reform its banking sector and revitalize the economy. This is precisely what we've been waiting for. A stable and reformed banking system is crucial for the dinar to gain value. Continued dialogue with international financial institutions, Prime Minister Al Sudani emphasized the importance of these reforms for overall development. He also highlighted the need for continued dialogue with international financial institutions, including the International Monetary Fund IMF and the Federal Reserve. This shows that Iraq is serious about getting its financial house in order a good sign indeed. JP Morgan's support and potential for growth. Now, Here's the most interesting part, Mr. Dimon praised the Iraqi government's efforts to improve both state-owned and private banks. He expressed support for the activities of the Iraq Development Fund, which focuses on rebuilding the country's infrastructure. But what does this mean for the dinar? When a major financial player like J.P. Morgan Chase expresses support for Iraq's economic reforms, it sends a strong signal to the international community. It suggests that Iraq is on the right track and there's potential for future growth. Stay tuned for more updates. And let's hope for positive strides in Iraq's economic journey.